Fishing the Midwest is presented by Larson FX, the multi-species, multi-use boat that's ready for whatever you are. Suzuki, the ultimate four-stroke outboard. Core Ice, expand your seasons. Hi, welcome to Fishing the Midwest. I'm Mike Frisch, thanks for stopping by. As you can see, we're ice fishing. Today, we're on Upper Red Lake in northern Minnesota. We're chasing walleyes through our core ice fish house. After that, it's the return of the anchovy kid. We're gonna chase smallmouth bass with our buddy Lincoln Hoagland, but first, let's get in the core ice and catch some walleyes. Today we're on Upper Red Lake, we're in northern Minnesota. Now Upper Red Lake is a famed walleye fishery, open water, but especially ice fishing. We're on the ice, we're chasing walleyes. Wow, that's slick. The cool thing today is we're fishing out of a core ice fish house. These are super lightweight, but super strong, very durable fishing shelters, and they're designed for the ice angler. We pull in, a matter of minutes, we have the house down, the holes drilled, and we're fishing. Well, that's a nice one. That's a nice one. Good job, Mark. Way to go, Mark. Good job, that's a fatty, too. Boy, it's a Red Lake fatty, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Nice. Look at that thing. Well, I caught the first walleye of the day. And because of that, you know, you always get bragging rights. I, I, I joke with my friends all the time, you don't have to catch a lot of fish to look good. You just have to catch the first one, right? <laughs> so. Yeah, that is a fatty. Let's see what that one measures. One. We got another one on, too. Jesse's got one on. Oh, boy. You pinched that tail down there. He actually spit it out and I caught him. There you go. Nice. Well, that one's even bigger. This one's just under 17, so that's a keeper. That's a keeper, yep. All right, let's see what Jesse's goes. Get him down about 18. Whoa. 18 and lively. Well, light lamb flat watch, There's Jesse. Another one down there. Yep, just over 18 and a quarter. He's a go backer. Good job, though. That's fun, huh? Yep, that's a good time. Yeah, I mean, this lake's just all about fishing, obviously. It's not scenery, it's not anything else. There's a lot of houses here, but there's a lot of space. So we got, uh, we got plenty of fish, plenty of room. All right, we got him, Mike. You got him? We got him. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one, Jesse. Look at him. Yeah. Woo, chunk. Yeah. Wow. This will be interesting to measure that one up. Boy, look at there. <laughs> Do they like that glow shot jig or what? <laughs> nice. There it is. Nice. Now they're nice and fat, healthy. So switching gears for me really paid off and it paid off almost immediately. I went to the red glow shot jig, the one that Jesse was using. I went to it, I get bit immediately and it's a good one. Game on. Oh, you got a good one here. Think so? Well, well after, after you go 0 for oh boy. 5. Oh my, <laughs> that thing's got a backbone on it. Okay. He's getting smaller. That's a beauty. Look that how fat that is. Woo! Got it. Thanks, Jess. I switched to the same lure that Jesse was catching him on, that low shot jig. That's a nice walleye here. Doesn't want to relax either, does he? He wants to fight more. Just a hair over 20. Twenty and a quarter. Nice that one. Yeah. That one's got an extra year or two on it. Yeah. Boy, oh, that's a beautiful mm. fish. Look how fat that is. Yeah. Back she goes. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on. You got a good one here. Hold on. Oh, 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 that one's really gone. What I plan on using a lot today is gonna be these buck shots. Put a little bit of rattle there on top of the fish. Oh, okay, I got it. Woo, look at that. Now, the hope would 
be up here on red light today that this would be under 17 as a keeper. That's been the challenge, huh? Let's see the board here. You don't think so? I don't think so. I think it's close. We're also trying a new lure that uh, Northland released, I believe, last year with, I think it's called a glow shot. So it has a little glow stick in it, and we're going to pull in a little bit more light. And on Red Lake, I mean, you're looking at 12, what, 12 feet of water, uh, and you have to use a little bit more noise sometimes. As, as dirty as this water is, you have to create some light to really tell the fish where to strike. It's I hope we're 16 and a half. We are 16 We and are 16 and a half. Nice. Ooh, we got lucky there. That's really going to be a nice eater. Fishing in the Midwest is made possible by beautiful Cabotogama Lake, gateway to Voyagers National Park. Ray Marine, simply superior. Northland Fishing Tackle, made by fishermen for fishermen. Peline, because we fish. Vexilar, own the ice. You know, ice fishing is a great family activity. It gets everyone outside, it's hey, a lot of fun. Got yeah, a Vexilar I can use? I sure do, here you go, bud. Thanks. You know, even kids enjoy a Vexilar. It's easy to use, it's like a fishing game. Hey, it's Dad, a Ruby got one, can I have one too? Sure, Rose, you can. Thanks. No problem. There's no doubt, Vexilar has been helping generations of ice anglers catch hey, more bud, fish. I'm ready to fish too, can I use your Vexilar? You sure can. To catch more fish, learn more at Vexilar.com. Core Ice expands your seasons by building houses using their revolutionary lightweight IntelliCore panels. These true structural composite panels are lightweight yet durable, extremely well insulated and waterproof too. Core Ice also offers models using their patented hybrid wheel skid system for the ultimate in portability. With models and configurations to fit the needs of all winter anglers, consider Core Ice and expand your seasons. Visit our website to find a dealer near you. Every angler has his favorite tools. A particular bait, the right rod, a net that never lets one get away. But all of these mean nothing if you don't have the ultimate tool as your foundation. Larson FX is your multi-species, multi-tool platform with tiller and dual console models ranging from 17 to 20 feet. Everything you need for catching any fish you want. Larson FX, are you ready? Visit your local Larson FX dealer or head to larsenfxseries.com for more information. We rise at 4 a.m., driven by an overwhelming passion. We're driven by the beasts that roam the waters of this great country. We don't think about stress, or bills, or Monday. We're fishermen, always ready. And as for the gear we hold, trust is everything. Never again should you sacrifice strength for style. The Team Lose Pro TI Speed Spool. Built for anything you set the hook on. Every time we go fishing, you know we got to tie one on. In all honesty, when do I not tie one on? <laughs> Every time I go on the water, I love to tie one on. Every day of the week, I like to tie one on. You may not know this about me, but every once in a while, I've been known to tie one on. Come on, man. Join the Strike King team. All you got to do, tie one on. <laughs> I think I always tie one on. Fish on. No, keep the fish on. on. Fish on. Keep the tension going. Nice one, Jesse. Good job, Jesse. Yeah, boy. Keep it going. Nice. And a boy. Well, what I love about walleye fishing is it's, it's probably the best tasting fish in Minnesota. I haven't done a ton of fishing in my life and most of my fishing memories from childhood involve walleye, so um, I love seeing those things. Right, I got a better line there. There we go. got a fish. Wow. Look at that, Mike. Boy, is that got your line. Whoa. Oh, boy. Oh boy. He's testing the drag on this little reel. Today what we're doing is we're jigging. These fish are active, they're aggressive, they're coming in. A lot of the fish that are coming in are eaten. We're using the Glow Shot Jig from Northland Tackle. Now we started with some variety, but we really narrowed it down to that red Glow Shot Jig, the eighth ounce size. That's been the key. These fish are smacking it. Oh boy, I think that one's even bigger. I think so. 
Well, I'm always hopeful. <laughs> <laughs> I like your optimism, Mark. Yeah, that's right. You need to get that head to turn. It's not the fish that you catch, it's the fish you think you're going to catch, isn't it? There you go. Oh, look at that. Yep. Oh, God. I just love how fat these things are. Yeah, they are. Here, I need to take it. There we go. Yeah, that is, uh... That is a chunk. Bring it up with the transducer, maybe? Okay, got it. There you go. Good job, Mark. Sweet. There's another nice one. Boom. Gosh. I've never caught so many fish on a single hook before, but man, that bow shot is really, yeah, really, really, really nice. It's a good lure. Oh, look at that. Not even that big, but look how fat that is. And he fought too, didn't he? Ooh. Yeah, it always makes it fun. Yep, absolutely. So, uh, you know, we got a little bit of chaos going on, but man, it's fish fighting chaos, and that's the best kind of chaos. Each man to himself. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice. That's a nice. nice red lake double. Yep, simultaneous. Yep. We work it out, we get the fish. Boy, it doesn't get much better. On um, the glow shot jig. It's a good little jig. Fishing the Midwest is brought to you by Big Stone Lake Tourism, the Midwest's newest winter hotspot. Beckman Nets, uncompromising quality. Strike King, tie one on. Distinctive cabinet design for all your commercial, residential, and retail fixture cabinetry needs. Every angler has his favorite tools. A particular bait, the right rod, a net that never lets one get away. But all of these mean nothing if you don't have the ultimate tool as your foundation. Larson FX is your multi-species, multi-tool platform with tiller and dual console models ranging from 17 to 20 feet. Everything you need for catching any fish you want. Larson FX, are you ready? Visit your local Larson FX dealer or head to larsenfxseries.com for more information. Lake Cabotogoma in Voyagers National Park is your year-round destination for experiencing nature at its finest. Enjoy the solitude of the pristine wilderness while having all the comforts of home available at the many full-service resorts. The fishing is world-class. So are all the other outdoor activities that are abundant in all the seasons. Cab is the perfect place for your family or group of friends, and Cab is an easy drive from anywhere in the Midwest. Cabotogoma Lake in northern Minnesota. Discover Cab now. Hannay's Marine is the largest Larson boat dealer in the world and has a huge selection of boats and accessories priced to fit any budget. Our knowledgeable and experienced experts will help you select from top fishing boat manufacturers, including Larson, G3, Bass Cat, and Yarcraft, and pontoons from Suncatcher. Now's the time to take advantage of manufacturer rebates of over $1,000 on select models and great financing rates. Your boat, your treasure, our business. Hannay's Marine, keeping you on the water. Closed captioning on Fishing the Midwest is provided by Offshore Tackle, the leader in trolling technology. Oh, he's not that big. I thought this fish was bigger than that. He's hungry, though. Yeah. Ooh. Come on. He does not want that. Come on, head turn. Got a hard 
Okay, now he's coming. Now he's coming. You got him? What can I do? There we go. Ooh, that's nice. Oh my goodness gracious, Mike. Huh? Look at that. Here, you hold your fist. <laughs> that one, uh, no. let me take credit for that. That one came through and that's just beautiful. Cold winter day, and we're staying warm up here on Upper Red Lake. Jesse, that's the other part about the IntelliCore panel, right? It's super warm material as well. Yeah, it is. We don't have any cold spots in the walls, as you noticed, because there are no studs in these walls. So it's just complete insulation all around. Yeah, and because of that, I can't remember the last time the heater kicked on. It's, it's amazing how warm we're staying in here today. I think that's one of the biggest things about that IntelliCore panel, Mike, is that, you know, because the material that we use for the construction, you know, that construction composite material, it's all insulation. So when we turn on that furnace, we don't have to heat up all the stationary wood and everything else in the furniture because our walls are strength, our walls are insulation. Uh, and that makes a giant difference. But yeah, I've been kind of timing it, to be honest with you. We're about an hour and 15 minutes since the furnace has kicked on. Today, in addition to that glow shot jig being really important, I'm using the Laser Light 75 Speed Spin from Luz. It's a small, lightweight spinning reel, and it's a reel that I don't know how many people in the ice fishing crowd know about, but you need to know about it. The other important piece to the equipment equation today is the right line. We're using Fluoro Ice and six pound test from P-Line. It handles really well in cold water. It's designed for cold water applications, so it handles really well. It's strong, it's abrasion resistant. We didn't break off these fish today because we were using the right line. That's a nice one. Oh, looks yeah. nice, yeah. Oh, oh, there you go. Yeah. There, come on, boy. I mean, catching walleye makes, uh, it really kind of makes the Minnesota fisherman. That is the pinnacle fish. That is the true telltale of who the fisherman is. All right, so I'll make some apologies here a little bit. Red Lake makes us all look like professionals, and today we all looked really good. That's a nice one. Yeah. Looks yeah. nice, yeah. Oh, oh, there you go. Yeah. There, come on, boy. Oh, no, that is a nice one. Wow. You got a mark? I bet oh, that's, yeah. oh. that's the best. That's the best one so far. I think so. Wish we had a hemostat. <laughs> <laughs> the hemostat went down the hole. The hemostat ago. went down the hole in the <laughs> three ring circus a while ago. That is a nice fish. You know, no matter how many times I've been out ice fishing, I can tell you it's not the fish you catch. It's not necessarily the equipment you use. Although I'm a big fan of the Core Ice Fish House, it's the people you spend your time with. The people you spend your time with and you create those experiences, whether it's with your children or with your friends, your business partners, that's ice fishing to me. Red Lake in a core ice fish house doesn't get much better than this. When we come back, we'll be on open water with the anchovy kid. It's the return of the anchovy kid when we come back. Fishing the Midwest team uses and recommends the services and products from these folks. K-Drill Ice Augers, drilling ice will never be the same. Penae's Marine, there are 10,000 lakes in Minnesota, but only one Hanes Marine. Lose. Feel the difference. Clear Lake. Drop your anchor in Clear Lake, Iowa. Forget everything you know about sonar. Now there's an easier way to find fish. Real Vision 3D Sonar from Ray Marine eliminates the guesswork. And it's only available on Axiom, our new blazing fast navigation display. Explore the underwater world from every angle. Spend less time fishing and more time catching. Real Vision 3D from Ray Marine. Simply superior. on the water, a concert in the shadow of legends, 
a day of fishing in one of the premier fisheries in the Midwest. These are just a few of the wonderful attractions Clear Lake has to offer. Nestled in northern Iowa, Clear Lake is known for its beautiful scenic landscapes, top-rated beaches, and yearly events. From the annual winter dance party to the blockbuster 4th of July celebration, Clear Lake has something for everyone. Stay at the shore and explore. Beckman Nets are back, and that's going to make lots of fishermen very happy. Beckman Nets are the best for both the fishermen and the fish. Beckman's coated nets are fish friendly to ensure the release of fish's safety. Beckman Nets come in handle lengths up to 9 feet, and the one piece yoke is incredibly durable, while the quick connect channel allows for an ultra fast connection of the handle to the yoke, and the features go on and on. If you need a new net, and if you don't have a Beckman, then you need a new net, check them out at participating fishing tackle dealers. Distinctive cabinet design manufactures commercial millwork, retail fixtures, and residential cabinetry. Serving the homeowner on up through the general contractor, there's no job too small or too large. Whether it's custom kitchens for the homeowner or retail fixtures for hospitals, hotels, casinos, banks, and more, Distinctive Cabinet Design can do the job for you. Visit their website to learn more. Distinctive Cabinet Design, serving Minnesota and the entire country since 1999. Fishing the Midwest is made possible by Bass Pro and Cabela's. Your adventure starts here. Garrison. Get hooked on Garrison on the north shore of beautiful Lake Sakakawea. Moor Lock. Get locked down. Welcome back to Fishing the Midwest. Hey, Red Lake's got walleyes. That was a great day. Now, we're going back with one of my fishing buddies, Lincoln Hoagland, the anchovy kid and I. Well, we got together again last fall and we chased smallmouth bass. Come along. So, Lincoln's a graduate of the Cabela's School of Fish and last year Lincoln was the young man who we drew from the drawing of all the kids who come to School of Fish classes, Lincoln won. So Lincoln and I came out here, same lake, about the same time of the year, and caught a bunch of smallmouth bass. And we just decided that it was such a fun shoot, Lincoln did such a good job that we wanted to do the encore of the anchovy kid. Who's got who, Lincoln? <laughs> okay, slow up, slow I got up. him. You got him? Yes. I think he's got you. <laughs> My favorite thing about fishing is, um, let me see, catching big fish. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he's backing away with it. Oh, he jumped over there. He hit the side of the boat. <laughs> we got a... <laughs> Oh, he's nice. nice. Look at that one, Lincoln. He's pretty good. Look at that one. Ooh. Ow. Look at, look at, what is that? What do you call that? A jellyfish thingy. <laughs> I thought you called it an anchovy. Um, oh, yeah. <laughs> my key to my success was changing my anchovies. Another part of fishing with kids that's important is, you might have it in your mind, like I had it in my mind today, we're gonna catch fish on a Strike King drop shot rig or on a Strike King tube. I think these ones would be better. Well, Lincoln said, hey Mike, can I change anchovies? Cause that's what Lincoln calls the baits. And you know what, when kids wanna change baits, let them change baits. Lincoln went to a Rage Baby Craw, caught a really nice Northern Pike on it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this one's good, a big let pike. A little, let a little line out so you can... Just luck. Just luck. Oh, wow. That thing's huge. Remember, you told me you are going to catch the biggest fish in the line. Yeah, is that... That's pretty big, isn't it? It's probably the biggest one. Look at him. Oh, wow. Is that the biggest fish you've ever caught? Yeah. Is it really? Yeah. <laughs> that rod up. Yeah. <laughs> okay, just take your gun. <laughs> the small mouth. Oh, that's a large mouth, Lincoln. 
Nice! That's a large mouth? Oh, that's a large mouth. That's a nice large mouth. See, notice cool. how oh, that cool, small cool. mouth that you caught before yeah. was brown. Yeah. And see how he's green? Typically, these largemouth live more in the weeds than the smallmouth like the rocky, harder bottom. Hey, here you go. Remember how to hold them? Yeah, but I want to hold them right there. You want to hold them right there? Yeah. Oh, that thing was heavy. Okay. There you go. Nice high five. <laughs> what are you doing? Floss. What's the floss? So the floss is like this dance that in Fortnite that my friends taught me. So Lincoln, we just caught some weeds. And some people say, oh, I caught a weed, that's no good. But you want to know what weeds are? They're habitat for where the fish live. Fish like to live in weeds. And look how long that weed is, and it's still kind of green. It's the fall, and the weeds are going to start dying pretty soon. The fish like the weeds that are still green living like this is. Kind of like you live in a house, fish leave, live in weeds. But one of the things I always like to do when I fish with kids is, I don't need to catch the fish, I want the kids to catch the fish. So we were using two rods, but when I hooked up, I would hand my rod to Lincoln. Hurry up. Keep them down, Lincoln. Keep them down. Oh, it's a nice small one. <laughs> Hi. Look at that, Lincoln. Look at you. Caught that one again. Right after you said. Is that look, a big mouth? That's a small mouth. He said, I got a fish, and he's cranking down. And I thought maybe it was another big northern, but it happened to be a really nice small mouth. A great way to end the day. That's the biggest one of the day right there, I think. Should we call it a day? We had a pretty good day? Yeah. <laughs> Lincoln's a neat kid, and that was a fun day. Anytime you're in the boat with a youngster and smallmouth bass are in the equation, it's probably going to be a good day. And Red Lake, glow shot jig walleyes, wow, that was a great day as well. Hey, from all of us from at Fishing the Midwest, thanks for stopping by. We'll see you again next time. And as always, remember to include a youngster in your next outdoors adventure. To see more things Fishing the Midwest, visit us on the web and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also, we have a great giveaway where you can win a bunch of tackle, fishing line, rod and reel, tackle boxes, and more. Like Fishing the Midwest on Facebook, and when you're there, see the link to our Real Times newsletter and subscribe. At the end of the TV season, we'll draw a Real Time subscriber's name, and if that person is a Facebook follower too, she or he wins all the gear. We'll see you again next week.